as as you get closer and closer to dates, you know they they continue to find ways to back away. So, for example, in this in this uh, in these minutes, what I've been able to pick up is uh, they, they there there was you know even you know some lack of uh, decidedness in terms of the wage pressures and some of the linkages between the tightness of the labor market, the unemployment rate, the jobless claims, and the like. And whether that filters through into the type of wage inflation that they need to see, so that they are confident over the medium term on the inflation outlook. So they're finding ways to wiggle away from, you know, pulling the trigger in September. We think the Fed will go this year. You know, whether or not September, I think, is a coin flip. To me, the most troubling issue for the Fed recently has been this drop in inflation expectations. But at the end of the day, if the Fed goes in September, they go in October, they go in December, we're still facing an environment in which the monetary regime is starting to change. The probability is still very high that the Fed raises rates in September, although it was a really, it was kind of like the statement itself um, with a lot of openings to do whatever they needed to do. They just edged themselves a little closer. It's like putting their toe into cold water. They, you know, are continuing to move to that point where they sort of, get into very gently lifting rates as gently as possible. And I think there's really nothing new to me in, in these minutes, although I think, you know, markets were looking for some clear sign. The Fed's not going to give it. They're saying, listen, we need a couple more months. They got one month of good employment. Um, we need to know inflation stabilizing. Well, the inflation was weak today, but core inflation is look, does look stable, and they've been heartened by that. So I think these minutes don't tell me you should bet against September. I think September is right on the table. You know, three weeks ago they thought it was a good chance, but not a, a certainty that they would raise rates in September. And clearly, the news since then would push a little bit away from that. You know, but not by a huge amount. So I suppose I'd still bet, although it's getting pretty close, that they would start to raise rates in September.